Hey, welcome back. We're just scrolling through the hard drive here. Heading down through the A's. See a missed opportunity right here. Going down into the B's. Here's a good scene we'll end up seeing. It's short. We'll end up seeing that someday. Oh, what's this right here? Bushwhacked. Huh. A week ago today we had Eric Roberts whacking people in CSI Miami with his axe in the whacked episode. Today we're looking at Bushwhacked. 1995 PG starring Daniel Stern, the late John Polito, Brad Sullivan, and Ann Dowd. A hapless delivery boy runs from the law after being framed for money laundering and murder. You know, I remember back in 1995 being in elementary school and all the kids were, oh, bushwhacked, oh, so bushwhacked, bushwhacked is so funny. Well, unless you're a little kid, bushwhacked's not funny. But we're going to go ahead and uh, take a look at a little scene here. I see that other guy loading money into suitcases, and I see Gordy's mom. Can I do a chair? What? Yes, what are we going to do? Thank you, sir. I'm faking! Yes, folks, the 1995 children's crappy comedy Bushwhacked, where we have Ann Dowd, kidnapped by the bad guys, the late John Polito, a crooked FBI agent, I think Brad Sullivan is the uh, main criminal, Ann gets a uh, white tape gag that uh, is on there pretty good and gets reapplied in a joking fashion by Jan Daniel Stern, or you may know him as Marv from Home Alone. Personally, I always liked his performance as uh, uh, Phil Brigman, <laughs> I think that's his name, the uh, pitching coach from Rookie of the Year, guy that uh, hot ice, gets stuck in the closet. Uh, yeah, so this movie, the scenes are decent, I mean, for what they are, there's a whole shit ton of rope on her on the chair, I don't really know what's going on there, um, but uh you know, this is just a ridiculous film, you know, because there's scenes like this. Absurd stuff. Um, it's a kids movie. I mean, it has the two kids from the movie Big Bully from 1996 with uh, Tom Arnold and Rick Moranis. That's that's a funny movie. That's one of my favorites from being from my childhood. But uh, yeah, the two kids that are in that play two of the little kids here. Basically, Daniel Stern's a crooked. Uh, I don't know. He gets he's a he gets mixed up with these 
money launderers and he ends up becoming a camp counselor for a day or something. I don't know. And they end up hiking up a mountain where the criminals are hit out. I don't know. It's ridiculous. But uh, these scenes you've probably never seen before. Uh, I know nobody else has them uploaded anywhere that I've ever seen. Um, not that they're the greatest scenes ever, but uh, it's a little something here on my collection I thought you might like to see. So that's what we got today. Subscribe, like, and comment. I'll see you tomorrow. I'm not really a scout leader. My name is Max, and I'm here to save you, okay? Now, be very quiet. You're a liar! You're a liar! Okay, we'll get to know each other later. All right. Now, what kind of nuts did the kids say these were? I'm gonna put potato hands hang out there. And fun boy, he lives here upstairs, all right? Fun boy. Walk out of here. They're gonna race your sorry ass. You're nothing but street grease, you hear it? Street grease, you motherfucker. Is that gasoline I smell? No, man. No! 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 no. Sword. Wise up, smart ass. Huh. Wanna hear another theory? This Fazil was so upset about lousy wrestling tonight. He went down to the garage and in a fit of depression cut off his own head. That's not funny, Walt. You faggot, Nash? Why, Garfield? You cruising for a piece of ass? <laughs>